Monster Collectibles. And as always, we're going to be doing some card openings because um, we're still waiting on mystery boxes to be coming in. And on top of that, we got Unicon this weekend. Uh, Unicon over here. Ooh, there we go. Unicon. Do it a little bit longer for you. Yeah, we got Unicon coming up. So it's been kind of hard to bring in mystery boxes because I don't know when they're going to be coming in. And uh, with the con coming up, we wanted to make sure we had stuff available at the booth. So, yeah. So what we can get our hands on is cards. And so, yeah, we're going to open up some cards. Uh, we got score football as always. We got some more Star Wars battle plans because we opened a box up last video and it was pretty fun. Pretty cool cards. And uh, if you're a big Star Wars fan, there's a lot of good things out there. Um, like, you know, uh, I think there's, there's definitely autographs. There's some... Uh, uh what was i gonna say some like i think a uh, movie worn like uh patches and everything like that uh, for the characters which are pretty cool we got some new pokemon coming out um just because my daughter's starting to get in a pokemon kick uh me too pretty much and so we found a couple of packs of cards we're gonna open those up and then of course this baby right here if any of you know when you go to like a walgreens or a cvs <coughs> <coughs> sorry if you go to a Walgreens or a CVS, you see this. And if you're always curious as to what's in here, it's usually not good. But this is what the video is for. You can see me open this up and, re and, you know, next time you're at a drugstore, you can go like, huh, okay, like, is it worth it? Most of the time it's not. You're getting some pretty awful cards, but it's still fun to open because it's like $5. So it's like low risk. And usually it's, it's just fun to crack open anyway. Um, but yeah, without further ado, um, we are going to try something a little bit different because, uh, my camera angle is all weird here, but we're going to start opening up some cards and we're going to see what's up. Um, as always, we are Mr. Collectibles. You can find us at the Paradise Valley Antique Mall, uh, on the corner of Pecos and Russell, uh, in Las Vegas. And, uh, this weekend, uh, October 1st to the 3rd, we are going to be at Unicon. So we will be at the Lycomic like, Con of Las Vegas. Uh, we're going to be at booth B14. So if you're watching this video and you want to come on by and take a look, uh, yeah, we'd love to have you there. We'd love to say hi. All right. So without further ado, we're going to start opening up some packs. Uh, we're going to start with, we'll go Pokemon first. So I'm going to move this closer here. We're going to get rid of some of these. My daughter's little chest she drew me, or she painted me for me as it's holding up all this stuff. So I'm trying to find a better way to display it. The last couple of videos, it's been kind of weird. But yeah, we'll do this. But I'll go, oh, you guys can't even see. There we go. All right. So let's get Pokemon cards first. Let's see what we get. So, of course, Pokemon cards, you want to get the full art VMAXs, stuff like that. Those would be fun. Let's see. I forgot where I picked these up at. I think I picked these up at Target. So, oh, goodness. Yeah, I have a bunch of uh, like old school Pokemon cards that um that i'll be bringing to unicon a bunch of base sets a couple first editions stuff like that some of the stuff's in eh condition because it was sitting in my mom it was sitting in my uh closet at my mom's place for the last 20 years so it's uh some of the stuff is moderately played but yeah so let's see what we got so we got drowsy scraggy let's see like that there we go we got, looks like a Smurf, Baggin. We got a Wobat. That's a common still. Common Timpole. Ooh. Well, oh, this is going to be the rare. Is that how, do they change things, how they work? Yep, that's the rare. So we got a Slay King. And, oh, we got a, okay, another one. Like I said, I haven't opened up Pokemon cards in a while. So Appleton Rare. Energy. No, that's a classic. Vigoroth, Lombri, and the old QR code. Okay. So I'm just going to go on an assumption and say that that slaking probably not a big hit because yeah, those V Maxes I know are good ones. But yeah, there he is right there. So, all right, put him there. Next pack. Yeah, there were some there's some pretty crazy cards in here. Some cards that are worth like like over like fifty bucks. A couple that are worth I think over a hundred. So
Oh my god. This is horrible to open up with gloves. There we go. This is going to be a long video because there are a lot of cards and a lot of packs. But, all right, we got an Applin. Uh, Litleo. Emolga. You know what, here, let's, what was it? Okay, we're going to go like that. We're going to see if we can do that card trick. Moon and Sun Badge. Pryor. Pryor. We got... Vigoroth. All right, we got that card. Go there. We got an energy. Oh man, there's a what's that bent corners. All right, we got the QR code. Tentacool. That's a classic. Pumpkaboo. Oh, we got a full art. Okay, we got a Flaffy. And. Espeon V. All right. Hey, I'll take that. Very nice. Pretty card. And this one survived. All the other cards had a bent corner. This one did not. So, very cool. Very nice card. Very pretty card. That's going to go straight into a sleeve. Let me go put these on. But yeah, those are the hits from the Pokemon pack. Very cool. Very, oops, sorry. Get the Flaffy in there. There we go. Awesome. Awesome. And, and yeah, that is. Let's see here. Pretty clean. Oh, is that white? Yeah, the little nick maybe in the corner. But yeah, very good card. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so next we'll go score. We'll chow through these score packs. Okay, so we've opened up score before, so of course these are all going to be, we're going to go, you know, quarterback hunting, and these are all going to be, uh, rookies are going to be in their college jerseys, but we've gotten some pretty fun cards out of this, so let's see, we're going to go, okay, now we'll just go like this, forget it, Derek Barnett, Dan Marino, Marquise Brown, having a good season, Jamison Crowder, Travis Kelsey, the man, Darius Slayton, God, really, the kicker's got to be upside down. Mason Crosby. Carl Lawson. Zach Cunningham. Corey Davis. Marquez Valdez-Cantling. Lou Keekley. All right, so we got Damon Hazleton Jr. I think that's like the like a red. Uh, Chris Boswell, that's another red. All right, we got Zeke Red... Uh, national champion nice okay trey lance rookie just regular white not the gold parallel next level stats tom brady uh we got the corners we got deshaun watson we got miles garrett alvin kamara nick chubb jamar chase uh next level what do we call it no sorry jamar chase rookie but not the gold parallel the next level Russ, got the linebacking greats, got Jonathan Taylor, John Randall game face, Jamar Jefferson rookie, all right, let's see, Tommy Tremble, Jalen Darden, Javon Holland, Michael Carter, Larry Roundtree, oh, what were they doing that? Larry Roundtree the third, now we go, here we go, Jerry Rice, Justin Herbert, second year. Brashard Perryman, Hassan Reddick, Drew Brees, Devo Samuel, and Bradley Chubb. So, out of all that, Trey Lance was probably the only thing half decent, I think, in there. And even then, that's only like a couple dollar card. But, let's see here. Yeah, Trey Lance, Jamar Chase. I think that was it. Let me see here. Yeah, everything else was kind of whatever. The reds or red parallels, like, that's yeah, pretty cool. But we'll sleeve those up. All right, we got five of these packs. So we got a, we got a lot of packs to open. This could be a long video, but I appreciate you guys. If you guys are just bored at home, you know, you can watch YouTube videos and watch me open up packs. I appreciate you all for following. So Tyler Boyd, Demarcus Lawrence, Rob Gronkowski, 
Jalen Hurts, Devontae Parker, Lamar, Deshaun Watson. How long will he still be a Texan at this point? James Conner, Peyton Manning old school. God, look at that face mask. That, man, they don't make those. Those are like, oh, I remember when he rocked that thing to start it off with. Ooh, that is a face mask. All right, Peyton Manning, Khalil Mack, old school. We got Randy Moss, Kareem Hunt. Okay, we got a red Panay Sewell rookie. That's not bad. Got a Jordan Poyer red. Nelson Aguilar. Could do better. Another game face Bosa. Julio Jones. All right, Justin Fields. Got a Justin Fields base. Uh, I forgot what they call it, like throwback or whatever. But yeah, not the gold parallel, but there we go. Got a Justin Herbert next level silver. Got the, oh, the Steelers greats. Drew Locke. Oh, there we go. Trevor Lawrence, national champion. Yep, silver. Got Justin Jefferson. Got the Giants. Zeke. Kyle Trask. Thielen. Oh, I got both Viking wide receivers. All right, got Ramondre Stevenson. JC Horn. Poor guy just broke his foot last week. No, okay, Justin Fields, base rookie. Just okay. I think this has got to be either an error or they just love doing this because I probably have opened up twenty or thirty score packs, and I got if I get that Justin Fields, I'm getting this one that follows him every single time. So we got Dwami Brown, Caleb Farley, Austin Eckler, Jimmy G, Jerry Judy. Steve Largent, Alec Ingold, ooh, Tom Brady in the throwback. That's kind of cool. And Kenyon Drake. I'll put that aside, too, because people love Tommy. Big game this week. He is playing the Patriots. And, of course, it is ripe with intrigue, that game. So, I secretly kind of want the Patriots to win. I like Tom Brady. I think he's a hell of a player. But, yeah. I, I don't know, man. I'd love to see if Bill Belichick can shut down take Tom Brady out of the game, that'd be pretty wild. Love to see that. He takes everything, everybody's, every other, ah, sorry, everybody else's best player out of the game. So let's see here. Evan Ingram, Thurman Thomas, Chase Young, Julian Edelman, T. Higgins, Dion, Leonard Fournette, Romeo Guara, oops, sorry, oh, Olamide Zacchaeus, Adam Thielen, Joe Schobert, DeAndre Swift, Todd Gurley, not on a team. I got some rookies. Jay Tafel, rookie. Red, Chase Claypool, second year. Oh, there we go. Ooh. Oh, we got Trevor Lawrence, red. All right, very nice, very nice. That's the first time I've seen a red one. Very cool, sweet, very nice. Show you guys, yeah. There he is. That's cool, nice, good find. All right, TJ, Christian, another Trey Lance base rookie. Hell yeah, I'll keep taking these Trey Lance rookies all day long. By far, I mean, I'm a 49er fan, so I'm a little biased, but so far out of all the rookie quarterbacks, <laughs> he's only played like five total plays, and he's got better numbers than every other rookie that's played so far. So we got uh, Tom Brady, next level. That's a red, that's basic, that's silver, yeah. All right, we got the cornerbacks again. We got Deshaun Watson score team. Oh, Joe Burrow second year. Okay, cool. Next level Claypool, Vikings greats. Next level Nick Chubb. Oh, good Kyle Pitts. I haven't had. I don't have a ton of Kyle Pitt rookies. I mean, I do. I have them in that horrible, like Sage set, but that's cool. I don't have a lot of Kyle Pitts. Very good. We got. Juju, another Panay Sewell rookie, this time not the red. Uh, Shaka Tooney, Joseph Osai, Javante Williams, Christian Derrissaw, another Jay Tufeli, or Tufeli, but not the red. And we got the commons. We got Hunter, Michael Thomas, Robert Woods, Trey Hendricks, Jamal Adams, and Henry Ruggs III. So we got two more packs. We're on 15 minutes here, so... I'm totally fine. I don't take offense if this is 
unboxing videos or unwrapping videos for you to fall asleep by. I don't mind it. I don't take offense to it. I know sometimes, uh, especially for the more avid sports, uh, sport cards or football card, basketball card collectors, me opening up Walgreens packs and scores don't really like elicit excitement because they're on the lower end spectrum, but I don't know, they're cheap, low risk. Like, you know, I'm not spending $300 or $400 on a box and get stuck with a, like, you know, a, you know, hell, don't know, but I'm not gonna get stuck with that. This is low cost here. I spend $5 on a pack. I probably w walk out with like 10, 15, $20 worth of cards, if not more. So Mike Gusecki, Mark Andrews. I mean, of course, if you have the money to, uh, to drop on those, like, you know, big boxes, uh, then yeah, like the, I forgot what they call blacks, the premieres or whatever, then more power to you. That's awesome. I, on the other hand, like opening up like $10 packs because they're just fun and cheap. So Frank Gore, Le'Veon, Saquon, Josh Allen, Fletcher Cox, Austin Hooper, T.Y., Old School Erlacher, A.J. Brown, Devontae, who destroyed my 49ers last week. <coughs> Sorry, guys, I have something stuck in my throat. Teddy Bridgewater. All right, let's see here. Got our Anthony Schwartz red rookie. Not, could have been better, but whatever. Darius Smith. Oh, we got a next level, next level red Kyler. We got 49ers linebacking greats. We got a collegiate champions there. It looks purple, so it might be, it might be something good. All right, we got score team Tua. We got second year, or no, not second year. Sorry, that was second year Tua. We got like 20th year Troy Polamalu. Score team Patty. Charles Woodson. Next level Derek Carr. Next level Stephon Diggs. Some other really good cornerbacks, current cornerbacks. Chase Claypool score team. Second year Joe Burrow. Man, this pack is a dud. Cooper Cup. Score team Justin Herbert. Oh, wow. Okay. Sean Wade. Shai Smith. Quincy Roche. Or Roche. Javian Hawkins. Kadarius Tony. Rondale Moore. Wow. That pack was... That pack, even for $5, or even, these cards are, yeah, you're not going to get your money back on these. JC Jackson, Christian Kirk, Jeremy Chin, Nick Bosa, Noah Fant, Tony Gonzalez.